What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebase.com. 2022 Hit Parade Baseball Limited Edition Series 14 just sold out. This is a dual case break. Random Teams number one, where we're getting 20 total boxes. So again, guys, first, we'll randomize customer names, teams, and then we'll do the break. But again, guys, uh, very nice stuff here in the Limited Edition. There's some of the preview case hits. You get one autograph per box. And here you go. Let go. Roll it. Five and a one six times. And again, customers that bought in straight up there. Customers that wanted from contenders pack for the 14 there as well. Congrats, guys. And again, that was six times. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Nestor down to Nestor. Six times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Mariners out of the Padres. All right, six times, six times. Nestor, you have the um, Mariners, Michael P. with the Astros, Lonnie with the Giants, Mike with the uh, Diamondbacks, Corey with the Rockets, or Rock, not <laughs> Rockets, Rockies. Dusty, you have the Yankees. Uh, <laughs> I kept saying Rockets. Uh, Chris Barron with the Phillies. Nestor, you have the Red Sox. Dusty with the Angels, Ryan with the Pirates, Chris with the Cardinals, John with the Dodgers, Nestor with the Cubs. Anton with the Marlins, Kevin with the Guardians, Eugene with the Braves, Jason with the White Sox, Chris with the Tigers, Bradley with the Twins, Lonnie with the Reds, Steven with the Nationals, and Blue Jays. Nestor, you have the Rangers, Dusty with the A's, Joshua with the Brewers, Chris Walker with the Royals, uh, Bill with the Rays, Dusty with the Mets, Ryan with the Orioles, and Nestor with the Padres. <laughs> That's right, honey. That is a Nestor sandwich there. All right, guys, so any trades? I'll leave the window open for like a quick minute. All right, guys, I'm assuming no trades. Close it. All right, so dual case, series 14. There it is. We have case three and case two, it looks like. Logan, um, me personally, no. No one's ever really stole anything significant, but we have caught some little kids like on a Friday where there's like 30 kids in here and they'll try to like, you know, put a pack in their pocket or their backpack and, you know, little, little things like that, but nothing like someone trying to steal like a high-end card or box or anything like that because it's usually within the showcase so but 
more like little kids. <laughs> It's like they're upset because they didn't have another five bucks for another pack or something, so they're just like, you know, they're just, uh, I was like, just ask, I mean, some, it's crazy because some kids come in here with like five bucks and really make the most out of it, and some kids come in here with a debit card, and they're like ten, and then they're in here, like one kid last week, it was a crazy weekend, like, I think I even said one kid dropped like six hundred bucks. I was like, whoa, dude, what the hell? So it's like, I guess it just depends, right? I know, right? Take him to the back. <laughs> but it's like when I first went to the Dallas card show back last year in March, like, you seen some kids that were like 14 years old walking around with just wads of cash. Like, we're talking thousands and stuff, making deals. It's crazy. But yeah, it, it just depends. I don't know, Evan told me one time this like 12 year old dropped like over a thousand. I was like, Jesus. These kids in here usually come like once a week and they're just so excited ripping like Bowman packs and stuff like that. Alright, first one is Ryan Mountcastle to 150. Uh, Orioles, that's going to Ryan. But yeah, I don't, I don't, thankfully nothing's super crazy. You know. When someone comes in the shop tries to steal, steal, but. Just more like little kids trying to like take advantage of a couple extra packs. Out of 25, you're a wizard, Ozzy. Ozzy Smith. St. Louis Cardinals. That is going to uh, Chris Walker. Jose Canseco. What a high tech autograph. Another one for Oakland. Oakland Dusty. I know. Times have changed, Logan. I know, right? <laughs> uh, no, I, I actually have not, Aaron. To be honest, it does seem like I'm gonna cut myself one day, though, right? I get really close, but no, I have not. Thankfully. Cabrian Hayes, purple to 150. Cool. Pirates. It's gonna Ryan. I've cut myself cutting fruit and vegetables one time though. I'm, I will I will not lie about that. That wasn't a fun time. Whoa. Thick mama. What's going on here? Oh, it's at Sterling. 2008 top Sterling. 6 out of 10. Robin Yao. We had a 9-5, oh, corners 8-5, and a uh, surface to 9 with a BGS 8 auto. There you go. That is a um, <clears throat> Milwaukee Brewer and Joshua. There you go, man. Was it? What? I think I was cutting a mixture of, like, fruits and stuff. But I, don't, I actually don't remember. I think it was a mixture of fruits, but... It was kind of like one of those where, like, you do that. So, yeah.
How badly have you guys ever cut your hands? Like, has it been really bad? Jordan Alvarez to 15. One time, one time my dad literally almost like chopped off his whole finger, like the tip of it. It was crazy. Houston Astros, Michael with that one. We have a Alec Bohm to 25. 13 out of 25 for the Phillies. Phillies going to Chris Parent. Ooh. So I got him in Puerto Vallarta when I went last year. <clears throat> Table saw? Jesus. Five tool phenom, Freddie Freeman at twenty five. Jesus, Logan, it's crazy. <clears throat> oh, was that a uh, case? Was that a sell sheet hit, Mike? I didn't even notice it. Let me see. Yes, it actually was. Is this a rookie order? Oh, it is a rookie order, actually. That's why. Very nice. Alright. That's uh, Eugene with the Braves, though. Last two here, guys. Or just save after cleaning a blade. I wrapped it in paper towel when I picked it up. Oh, my God. My dad, early in, like, in his life, when he first started working for the company, he worked for like 30 years. Hold on one second. We had Jay Cronenworth for the Padres at 35. Uh, that's Padres uh, Nestor. But uh, yeah, my dad, like early when he worked in his, like the company he was working at with machines and stuff. I don't know what happened, but it was like an accident. But he ended up like literally like cutting off like his index finger, like literally like this part of like, I don't know how, I don't know how to describe it, but like they cut it off basically. And like um, he had to like get like, like basically meat from like his like stomach, I remember correctly. And so like they somehow <laughs> put the meat here on his finger. So right here, it was all just like very dark, right? Literally, it was like all very dark. His index finger was shorter than like, like almost as hard as his thumb now. And then somehow like his like, his, um, his nail like, I don't know, like had a little like curve to it. So like, you know, growing up as a kid, I was always like, what the hell's with this? But yeah, told me when I got older, like, he had cut like his finger off, but it was wild. It was weird. But yeah, he said he had to like they had to cut some meat off of his stomach or something, and, and yeah, it was, it was it was crazy. Everybody always used to kind of just kind of make fun of his finger. All right, last hit of the box, and a Salvador Perez. Kansas City, Chris Walker. All right, so there you go. First case in the book. So we did get a sell sheet here right there. Thank you, Mike, for pointing that out. We got Jordan. And some other very nice hits here. Now, thankfully, this is a two-case break. So let's get the next one rolling. And thankfully, too, you know, knock on wood, I hope I, just, I hope I don't get injured, but I never really had a freak injury. I think the only time I ever had, like, an injury growing up was, like, in, like, seventh grade or sixth grade. I was running to, like, practice across the street from my house, and you know how sometimes uh, in some schools, like, let's say it's outdoors, and they had, like, you know, they had uh, basketball courts. Well, there was, like, little holes, right, so you could put the poles in for, like, volleyball. I was running with my cleats, and my foot, like, got twisted in there, and I broke, like, three or four toes. Thankfully, it wasn't, like, my whole leg or ankle, or my whole foot or ankle, but that's, like, the only major injury I had, minus, like, my thumb when I was a kid. Uh, I was a little, I was a little uh, troublemaker kid at Costco, 
I went under a Costco, literally Costco cart. My mom was driving it. I still remember this because it was like scarred. I was like five years old. So I, I went under a Costco cart and I was just dragging my hands, right? Just like on the ground as my mom pushed it. And then suddenly my mom stopped and like my hand got trapped and boom, broke my thumb like that. And I just remember like crying like, ah. So like now I can kind of do like this weird like thumb thing. And that's, that's the only two, like, ever crazy injuries I've ever had. <laughs> but other than that, yeah. Oh, do we have a big hit here? Ooh. Look at that. You receive an entry into our giveaway for a Luka Doncic autograph jersey. And a Jason Dominguez Bowman Chrome Mega Box Pink Refractor PSA 10. And I don't want to give out the code, obviously. Let's block that code. But basically, what I've, what I've done is uh, whoever... Gets this hit, also gets this as well. So there's that right there. There's like a specific code right there that you can enter to that. And uh, it is a Randy or Rosarania out of 25. Very nice. There you go. So uh, Tampa Bay Rays, Bill Norton. So there you go. So I'm going to throw in this attached with your card. And hopefully you can win. Doesn't necessarily mean you, you win something, but you got a little entry into a giveaway. So, a little bonus right there. That's right, Logan. I remember that, man. I, I, I remember when you came into the chat and you told me and Joe. And I felt so bad, but it was just, I, I couldn't stop laughing because I feel like I remember you were talking about, like, how hard it took you to like type out chatting to us <laughs> we're just like i vividly picture you literally trying to type with your arms broken and i was just like man it's rough but i remember you literally told me that right like you like trying to brace yourself and you fell and like your arms broke <laughs> i was like man that's horrible it's like poor logan he's just trying to chat with us but he can't We have a Bobby Dell back to 200. Boston Red Sox, that is Nestor. Yeah, it's funny now for sure. But I'm glad you did recover though, man. That's crazy. To break like not not just one arm, but both arms. It's crazy. Out of 99, Jonathan India from an archive signature series. That's for uh, Lonnie and the Reds. All right, 88. We have a Spencer Torkelson prospect RPAs or pa prospect jersey autographs. I should say not RPAs. Two color patch and autograph. That is number to 25 for Detroit. Going to Chris D. Judge, and I believe this is the other sell sheet here. Purple, number to 35 from 2017 Prism Baseball. That's a rookie Aaron Judge. How about that? For the Yankees going to Dusty. So that's 33 out of 35. And as you can see, that is a sell sheet too as well. Aaron Judge. So that's a rookie from 2017. So there you go. Very nice. All right. Halfway through. Halfway through. No, 
Five star Chris Bryant to 15. 9 out of 15 Chicago Cubs. Cubbies going to Nestor. And a Walker Bueller from a collegiate NT baseball to 99. So that's still obviously still currently with the Dodgers. So Dodgers going to John. Cabrian Hayes from Gold Standard, and that's from Chronicles. Nice Gold Standard. Pirates, Ryan Last Spot Mojo. Two boxes left, box one out of 100 coming out. Gary Cole for the Houston Astros. Going to Michael P. And last one. 68 out of 100. And Jared Kalanick. Inception Baseball Autograph to 99. Seattle Mariners. Nestor. There you go. All right. And there you go, guys. That was the break there. That was a limited baseball series 14 dual case break. Grand number one on jazbeescasebreaks.com, guys. Appreciate it. More hit parade in the store, guys.